New World has come a long way. No, really, a long way way however there are still some big features that i think are missing that can make the game so much more and finally live up to what we all hoped it would be in this video i'm going to be going over those things specifically i'm going to start from the least important to me all the way up to the most important to me so stick with it jumping right into things i'm going to combine a couple here and that is going to be searching and sorting mechanics for your gear as well as just that we're still getting a bit too much gear and a lot of it isn't anything we need so when you compare it to a system like world of warcraft where you don't get near nearly as much loot but when you do get loot you're basically just going through a shorter amount of items or rather a smaller amount of items and looking for a higher item level of that specific item whereas in new world you get a bunch of different gear at a bunch of different item levels and then you just have to sort through it to find exactly what perks you want and you're going to find a piece that has this perk you want but is missing the others and another piece that has one of the ones that's missing but it doesn't have the one that you had on the other one and so you're just sifting through a lot and doing a lot of compromising when you have to sift through everything having to search and do things with it they have it currently set up just isn't the most ideal and i think that they could still fine tune this system a bit better next up i think the game is still due for some optimizations and i mean just overall performance as well as the desync and just making the game feel better when in combat whether it be pve or pve i think that still going into towns no matter how good your system is you can have a 49 or 13900k like me and if you go into a busy city that fps drop and the stutters are massive so any sort of optimization they could do I think would still make the game more viable and more enjoyable for a lot of people out there who may not have the highest in PCs or even if they do they just hate when that FPS drops the way that it does we've also seen this happen a lot with the new territory battles that we've seen going on in the open world PvP where people get there and it is super laggy lots of desync and while the actual events can be really cool it just makes it far less enjoyable in the same ballpark while they're optimizing things overall I would love to see combat fine-tuned a little bit I still find that it's a bit spammy especially in pve it's a lot of just click 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 on the enemy occasionally hitting one of your ability buttons and it just doesn't provide a lot of crazy good game player differences it feels very spammy now that is one of the faults of action combat i think so maybe there isn't a great way to work around but it's something i would like to see improved if possible i also think combat could be a little more punishing so there are a lot of times i'm in these m2s or m3s now and so many people just aren't even using their dodge. They're just willing to tank all of these, you know, AOE attacks or slams because it only takes them down like 75%. And then me as the healer just needs to get them back up to full. They're willing to take these chances and not even do the mechanics of rolling or, or dodging any of these attacks because it just isn't that punishing. I would like to see some of these things tuned a little bit more to make DPS and to make these rolls actually have to play around a little bit and not just be stuck in spamming. The the next one is going to be something that we already know is coming and that is cross world everything i mean the fact that they have opr and i've had it for months i want to see that for expeditions i want to see it for arenas i want to see it for every type of content if you want to be able to group up for a specific quest let's make that cross world i mean that's the kind of sharding thing where if you group up with people then you can go and do other things on your own sort of shard and i think that new world really needs that especially expeditions right now i know it's coming in the december update but man is it annoying that even after an expansion when everything is at peak in terms of player count it is sometimes still very difficult to be able to find tanks or even to find groups to run some of the content in terms of expeditions and mutators that shouldn't be happening when the game just released an expansion and there are the most players that there are so i know it's coming but it's something i had to throw in this list we need cross world for everything due to how small they make their servers so thank you amazon for getting that out but it's coming a little later than I would have liked. And the last major thing, the biggest thing that I think the game needs is a full-fledged raid. This is what the end game is in so many other MMORPGs is yeah, you run the dungeons, you do the other content to get as strong as possible to then test your metal in a raid with multiple really difficult mechanically heavy bosses that require coordination good gear and smarts they tested raid bosses with the sandworm although that was a whole thing because like you needed better gear to kill it than you get from it so hopefully they also solve some of that if they release a full-fledged raid which they desperately need to because a lot of people get to the end game and pretty quickly you're able to do m2s and then you're in m3s and then you're just like well what am i progressing towards now if it took longer to get to that point maybe you'd be like okay fine but people are getting there in a week two weeks three weeks max really if they're playing the game even somewhat regularly with that being said end game raids need to be something that people strive for and they progress through just like we see in other games you know you go in and you 
you try to get through it, you get the first couple of bosses down, and you're just progressing each week. You have a raid night, and you're progressing. I think that would be great for newer. It'd be something very fun and exciting, but it needs to be rewarding. There needs to be special things, whether it's artifacts, legendaries, whatever it might be, that you get from doing it that are better than what you are getting from running dungeons. Otherwise, what's the point? But that wraps up what I think the game needs. So, what do you think? Let me know down in the comments. Did I miss something? Do you disagree with something that I said? I want to know everything that is in your mind when it comes to what New World needs for the future. With that being said, if you like MMORPG or New World content, please do consider subscribing to the channel. And of course, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. And until next time, good luck in your adventures.